What's up my ninjas? This is the Enigmatic Gamer. Welcome back. Watch more Let's Play Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Last time, we got some more fights in and this egg started to follow us for some reason. Now in this episode, we're going to get some more fights in and climb the, and climb the ranks even farther. We have the Punk Rocks. To avoid using special moves once again. Alright, now I'm going to switch up my uh, badges for one second. I'm going to get rid of power rounds and uh, power smash to get quake hammer and uh, sure let's keep power smash uh, all I can do is wait now let's do this There's a reason I took I put on Quick Hammer instead of instead of uh, keeping it as is. Because if you remember, these are clefs, and clefs don't really are useless like this. We get more money. Seven coins this time, and we go up to 12th place. Oh, and King K is gone. Other than that, I'm gonna take a nap real quick. And let's reserve another match. We're going against the bob -omb Squad this time. And this time we can't use our hammer. Not even once. So. Let me do a quick badge. Re I promise you, once I, get a, once I get more badge points, this is going to be... I can have as many badges as I want on it. Excuse me. Alright, let's do this. So remember, in this fight, we can't use our hammer, so... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have to oops, power shell. Have Mario use multi bounce. Yeah. Ah, crap, I didn't do it right. Okay. Oh, what? What? Uh. Okay. I was not expecting that. <laughs> it's quite lonely wh without King K around. Bomb! No lonely. Him too weak. Now him not here. So normal for Clefter. Two Clefter. You are in bomb denial, Clefter. I saw you weeping in that locker room. Bomb, bomb! Ooh. Right this way, Sir Swoop. This is your dressing room. You're starting in the minor league, of course, as you've just now started your career. You don't like this dingy locker room? I suggest you work your way up through the ranks. When you're ready to fight, just log onto this computer terminal here. Mr. Grubba then will decide who you'll match up against. You will have no say in this. Why don't you try it once? Walk up to the screen. Okay. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, howdy, sir, Swoop. Ready to get your wings dirty, huh? There you go, son. I got a treat for you. Your first battle is going to be against the Goomba Bros. 
Don't you worry about them. They'll be a piece of cake. Just mop them up. Hey, we want to get the crowd fired up, so do a move where you do a triple flip and meow. You got any questions about the detail rules? Just ask lovely Miss Jolene, okay, son? Well, good luck, pard. Okay, your battle is reserved. At this point, you just wait until security comes for you. Fighting is pretty basic. The team that drops the opponent's HP to zero first wins. If you beat an opponent who ranks above you, your ranking will go up. Then again, if you lose to a lower ranking opponent, your ranking will go down. Simply winning is not enough. When Mr. Grubba sets fight conditions, follow them. In this case, the condition is to do a triple flip and then meow. Fairly easy. If you satisfy the condition and win, you can battle a higher rank opponent next. If you can get your rank up to 11, you'll get a major, you'll get a shot at the major league. That's about all you need to know for now. Did you understand all that? Okay, good. For now, just wait until security comes to get you, Mr. Swoop, Sir Swoop. Um, hi guys. Yeah, my name is Swoop, Sir Swoop. I mean, nice to meet you. You, yes you, Sir Swoop. Time for your battle, bub. Follow me. Ha, <laughs> try not to get completely destroyed out there. Alright. Alright guys, I'm going to take a quick break, but I will be right back, alright? Alright. What's up my ninjas? Back from break. Okay, so, uh, a quick thing about what happened. Um, my laptop crashed while I was recording, but luckily everything saved. So, I'm just picking up from where I left off. Uh, okay. Next week opponent is... Rank 10 in the good spit, the Armored Harriers. We're going into the Major League now. Okay. We can't use our jump. Okay. So, I'm going to switch to Gumbella this time. There's a special reason why. And let me give Koops some... There's a special reason why I'm switching to Gumbella. All right, you'll see. You'll see why. And now today's main event: the Major League awaits the 11th ranked Ray Gonzalez, but only if he can beat the 10th ranked powerhouses, the Iron Adonis Twins. First, let's bring out the Mercer's Executioner, folks. Here's the Great Gonzalez. Gonzalez, kick their iron tails! Don't you dare lose, dude! Love the mustache. Woo wee! The great Gonzalez. How you feeling? Brr. Woo Nelly! You just heard him. heard the fella, folks. He's obviously itching to mix it up with some. Are spikes legal? Yep. Uh-huh. Damn! He's talking for us. Okay. There's a special reason why I chose Kimbella to start with. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. We're not giving up. All right, now I'm gonna have her tattle. That's an iron clap. And this guy is scary. Period. Max HP is six. Attack is four. And defense is unknown. What's with this bug? It says no attack will work against iron claps. It says nothing in the world is as hard as an iron clap is. So its defense is impenetrable. If that's true, the only way to beat it is to whack it with another one. All right. So you heard Gumbella. The only way to so the only way to win, I mean, I mean the best thing, not, not way to win, but the best thing to do right now is to run. So, the Armored Harrier wins. Okay.
Yeah, our friends. Yeah, our egg friend is gone. Huh? Our egg hatched, guys, while we're in the middle of the match. Gonzalez, check me out. Thanks to you, I hatched safe and sound. Thanks, man. What? You you were in that cute little eggy weggy? Whoa, that's wild. Yeah, but who cares? You guys want to be champs, right? You want a crystal star? I heard all about it while I was in the egg. Yeah. Anyway, I gotta repay you for saving my child. Saving from that old hoggle out there. So I'll fight for you. I can hold my own. I'll swallow any opponent who... Hold oh, Onyx, just leave it to me. Huh? My name? Let's see. I just came out of that egg, so I guess I don't have a name yet. You seem fired up about it, so why don't you give me one? Make it cool, okay? N okay! This is the part where I... This is the part, okay. Um, I was... I already... I was gonna ask you guys to pick a name, but I already have a name picked out. There's a reason why I named it Adam Cole, all right? And you'll see why. Hmm, Adam Cole, huh? Not too bad, dude, not too bad at all. Yeah, I like it. There, <laughs> the Yoshi is now your friend. He'll, resp he'll answer to Adam Cole. There's, all right, so a new partner. Press X to get on, get on and off the Yoshi. And then, while riding Yoshi, you'll move much faster. Also, uh, yep. Do a little flutter kick. Okay. You can go to inhale enemies and hold, hold and spit them out for massive damage. Yeah, we have a new yo. So we have a new partner in in our Yoshi, which we named Adam Cole, or I named it. Remember, there's a special reason I would name it Adam Cole. For those who for those who have played this game, you probably know why. And we can't use special moves again. All right, it's time for our rematch. All right, so we can so we can't use special moves. All right, now I'm gonna have Mario defend, and now for um, our Yoshi, which we named Adam Cole. <laughs> uh, since ground pounding won't work, we gulp them. Ouch! You spiked me right in the. That really hurt. Our iron bodies and pointy nastiness are being used against us. No fair. Oh dang, bro! He discovered our weak points. Yep, that's their weak point. So, we have Yoshi go again. And that'll do it. Ooh. Yep. And we are in and we are now a made in the major league. I like it. I like it a lot. Mr. Grubbo wishes to see us.
Mr. Grubba, I brought Mr. Gonzalez as he requested. M -m Miss Jolene, you mind your manners now. We knock around here, Missy. I apologize, Mr. Grubba. Don't you worry your pretty little head about it, none. Now, what did I want again? Something about Gonzalez. Oh, yeah. Gonzalez, you old so and so. Let me congratulate you, son. Major League already, huh? I had a feeling you. You were good. You were going places, but dang! I love it when I'm right. You just keep putting Tukuses on them seats. I'm counting on you, son. I got a little something, something for you. Go on, take it. 30 coins? Sweet. So, yeah, something else went on my mind. Your costume ain't cool. No big deal, son, but hey, someday if you get, become a champion, I'm get you a new one. Some hot pink, maybe. With some frills or something. You'll, you'll look a sight, son. Anyway, that's something for another day, Par. Take a powder, okay? Mr. Gonzalez, please follow me if you would. This is the Major League locker room. You will use this room from this moment on. The match system is the same as the minor league, but the bouts are harder. Try not to get completely- Jeez! Thanks for that vulgar confidence! Okay. Ha! <laughs> for a little friendliness. Still the guy coming through. Listen up, losers. I've been hearing about some some rising star tearing up the league. It's you, isn't it? Yeah, you fit the bill, Skinny. A mustache named Gonzalez. Man, I came all the way here for you. Ha ha ha! What a waste of time. Oh. What's your deal, Gonzalez? Huh? Oh, the champ's belt. What in the? Hey, you! Get too close on the hockey, you might get rocked! I'm not sure, but it definitely looks weird. I think you're right, Gonzalez. Fake! Hmm. Hey, you th hey, you think you just smack talk to the rock hawk? I don't think so! You got some guts calling my belt the fake, you shrimpy Nobel having wimps! Didn't your mama teach you, to ha teach you any manners? Whoa, sorry, yellow dude. Didn't mean to rip on your big bad belt. Stop making fun of me, punk! You're only a... You're alive only because we ain't in the ring right now. If I see you under those lights, I'll tear you apart. Remember the rock! Wow, I really pushed that dude's buttons, huh? Well, forget him. We got a problem. You're mad pointing to Glitzville, right? If that dude's belt is, has a fake crystal star on it, then where the heck is the real one at? Hmm. If you want the crystal star, heed my instructions from X. Who the heck is this X dude? He talks like he's the man who... He's the man to see about the crystal star. Why would he want to help us out, though? That's... that's this whole deal seems kind of whack. Uh... Or Yoshi's right. It does seem kind of weird. So let's reserve a match. The tiny spinies. So we can't use any special moves once again. Alright, I'm gonna switch up once more. I think the next time I'm gonna, the next time I level up, I'm probably gonna level up badge points because this is getting kind of ridiculous. We 
can't use special moves, of course. Jeez, the level up can't come any can't come any quicker. So let's go ahead and reserve another match. Not wasting any time. All right, next opponents will be. The poker faces. Ba 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 poker face. Ba ba poker face. All right, so we can't use our jump. No problem. Oh, these guys. Can't use our jump. That doesn't mean we can't use our hammer. I, honestly, I thought that wouldn't work. <laughs> honestly, I didn't, I just did not think that would work. Another email. Go to the watering hole outside the glitz pit from X. Okay. So we're gonna so we're gonna follow what X said, but we're gonna do this next time because we're about out of time. So next time on Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door, we follow X's instructions and go to the watering hole to find out to find out about the crystal star. See you guys then.